I look like the cat in the hat. What's up YouTube, it's your girl Nabea Mache and welcome back to another video today. As you guys can tell by today's title, I am doing a Shein haul. And if you're unaware of what Shein is, it is a fast fashion place where you can get some somewhat cute, cheap clothes from. You guys don't know this yet, but at the end of this week, I am going on vacation. It was so last minute, so I needed something quick and cheap to, you feel me, look good while I'm out of state. So I just have a few things to put a couple of outfits together and... With that being said, let's get into this video. So we're gonna start off with the tops. And the first thing that I put on was this very, really cute red and white crop top. Now, honestly, this is like a perfect crop. I have on high-waisted pants right now. So it still show a little midriff with the high-waisted pants. And then if I had on low-waisted pants, it would show a little bit more of the midriff. Now, I got this shirt in an extra small, I think. And I'm very petite, guys, and it's, it's small it's a little tight up here but it's cool it's cute and it doesn't have a smell on it and it's not thin now if you guys are aware with Shein, is she thin that's what it really should be she's thin but i get this shirt um i give it a nine out of ten because the red isn't as vibrant as it showed online and i'm not sure who this woman is on this shirt but you go girl the next thing i got is this Shein basic turtleneck y'all it's thick i don't know what she in is putting in a fabric but it's getting thicker each time i move on but it stinks it smells like elmer's glue but it's a really cute turtleneck i honestly got this to go under something which i'm going to show to you guys next but i want to show you guys this alone because it's actually really cute only thing i don't like about it is the neck is giving none like it needs to just be a little bit tighter you know like a little bit tighter around the neck and then it'll be perfect but I give this shirt a 6 out of 10 because it stinks and then like I said neck is giving none. So here's the shirt that I got to put on top of it and this is very misleading because it was supposed to be a crop vest and this is like long and it's thin, thin in like I said and um it's supposed to be a little bit tighter. I got a small and they I think this is in a petite section. I'm pretty sure I'm not don't quote me on it but I could like work with it. You guys, it looks a mess now, but if when you guys see the outfit, you're gonna get the vision. This is just the top of it. And the, like I told y'all before, this neck is giving none. Like if this neck was a little bit tighter, let's just say that was a little bit tighter. This shirt was cropped as if it was supposed to be. Like I don't even need that extra pink lining. I feel like I don't know. Let's let's try to drop that it up. Does this look stupid? Yes, it looks very stupid. I don't know. I give this a 4 out of 10 because this was all the way misleading. Like, this shirt is huge. And this is supposed to be a small, extra small. But it's a pretty cute shirt. And if I could, like, doctor it up before my vacation, then I guess. But as of right now, next I have is this bodysuit. Now, I got this to match with some pants. And I'm going to show you guys in a quick second. But I just want to say this, I could say it's giving skims, but skims have a different like feeling, but it's almost there. It's, it's not bad. It's it's not as see-through as it could be, and it doesn't stink. So I'm going to give this shirt a, a 7 out of 10 because first off, it looks like I've been stretching on this. I wanted it to be like a perfect tight, you feel me? Tight neckline, but it's she in. It's hit or miss. But yeah, so... I give this shirt a 7 out of 10. It's pretty cute. It's a little bit lighter than what it was on the website, but that's okay because I can work with it. Here are the pants, y'all. I hope y'all can see, but they're just some camo cargo pants. Now, unfortunately, they do not fit, and yes, these are the smallest size, but like I said at the beginning, I'm a very petite girl. So I don't really look for everything to fit me because I am small, but um... I'm kind of sad about them, but I got a life hack. I was watching either Yanni or Soleil. I still can't tell them apart, but I was watching one of them and they are also very petite. And she was like, just take the pants, take these two loops right here, use a shoestring and like tie it in the back. It's gonna be a little bunched up, but you're gonna get used to it. And then let me move my hair for y'all. And then bam, the pants are snatched at the waist. Like it's either that or your pants just gonna be sagging like it's not too much bigger but like i can't walk around with these p 
pants like this like the, the more I walk the more they're gonna fall down but I actually do like them and they actually feel like pants like they don't feel cheap so I'm gonna give these pants an 8 out of 10 like I said I wasn't expecting them to fit me perfect because I am a little bit smaller than most so yeah so like I love these pants and the shirt does go with the wheel I feel like I need something like another green because it's green in the pants I need something green to bring the outfit together but yeah I like these pants they're really cute I'll give them an 8 out of 10 the next is another basic bodysuit just in black this shirt is by far my favorite I just love black and I just love it. It feels nice and it's tight. It's tight around the right here. It doesn't look like I've been pulling up, pulling on it. I also got some bottoms to go with this shirt, which I'm gonna show you guys in a minute. But yeah, I do like this. I think this is this is everything is in a small. This is in the small, and I rate it 10 out of 10. It's really cute, really simple, and it fits really nice. Next thing I got is this skirt, y'all. This skirt is itty bitty, and I haven't worn a skirt in three years, so I don't know. The first thing about size when it comes to a skirt but i guess for my mini skirt girls this is perfect but um you guys are a little self-conscious when it comes to my legs and stuff being out but i really like it i'm really maybe i should pull it not if i pull it up a little bit more my butt don't be showing but i'm actually really feeling the skirt like like it is a little short but i could put some spanks on underneath and I don't know. I'm just really feeling this. I give it a, I give it an eight out of ten because I'm not a skirt wearing girl, so it's not me. But I like it. Like it's really, it's, it's really cute, and it's smaller size, and I still got a gap back here. But yeah, this is really cute. Eight out of ten. Next, I have this workout set. I actually bought them separately. This actually came with the black shirt it's the same exact design same exact fit it's just black and then i got these ribbed workout leggings y'all these leggings are literally hugging me like a freaking glove i look good now i bought this set well i bought this stuff because when i have workout clothes it motivates me to go work out honestly or even go in my loft and maybe ride the pedal time and lift weights or something but I give every I give both of these things a 10 out of 10. They fit how they show that they fit. And yeah, my leggings, I'm not gonna lie, y'all. I sometimes I'm my breath. I sometimes have to roll my leggings because they're too big. But like y'all, these leggings are literally fitting. Like they're not rolled. I promise y'all I didn't roll these leggings. And the same thing with the shirt. Well, I never really had issues with shirts because I got boobs, but y'all. 10 out of 10 will recommend go ahead and go get you some workout stuff from she in and they're soft like these ain't these are soft workout leggings and i think yeah, the inside is more like the sweat catcher thing but the outside they're really soft 10 out of 10 this is so cute and last thing in the clothing section i got is these very cute silk brown pajamas if you guys don't know your girl is a brown kind of sewer and I love this. Now, when I was on the website, this right here wasn't pink. It was like another, like a lighter shade of brown. But I'm not mad at it. It's pretty cute in it. The pink matches with my silk sheets. And they're cute. They're comfortable. They fit me, y'all. Like, they actually, they actually fit. Again, don't have to roll up my pajamas. Super stoked for me. I like these. I give these a... I give this an 8 out of 10 because they, they're they not, I don't know, maybe it's because they're made two different places, but they don't feel like my silk sheets, but they're very cute. And I definitely would recommend, like, if you guys are having a sleepover or something, get everybody a pair of these. Or everybody can buy their own pair of these because they're only $14, $15. So, these are pretty cute. I like these. Uh, what did I say? 8 out of 10? I'm not sure what I said, but that's what i rated next thing i got is this really cute eye mask and it was supposed to match the scrubs because like i said it the lining was supposed to be like this color like this right here is supposed to be this color but it's this is so cute now i bought this eye mask because i am going to be staying with my eye when i go out of the state and i just want to be able to get some good sleep because everybody don't like to sleep in the dark and i do so i'm just gonna 
you know you know cover my eyes and i think i seen something on pinterest it was like girl put that eye mask on your face and get you some good sleep tonight and i was just like oh i gotta give me one and it's silk y'all it's silk because it's so cute but i almost fell asleep but yeah i give this a 10 out of 10 you can't really write it bad and it fits maybe it only fits because i got a big head and i got braids the next thing i got is a brown bonnet of course to match my brown pajamas i really don't i do need another bonnet i only got one bonnet and it's the red dirty bonnet but i got this brown bonnet oh it's actually a pretty decent size i thought this was going to be like itty bitty y'all sleeping on shein bonnets and it's reversible all right now shein all right now all right now okay it don't it don't really match my pajamas but who's looking that hard Oh, this is so cute. I really like this. I'm just going to have to go order me some more colors. This is too cute. I like this. Next thing I got is some socks, y'all. It's just some swatch socks to go with one of the outfits. Y'all already know what swatch socks look like. And then I got some house shoes. And they don't look like how they look on that website. They look very... Okay. I guess they starting to look, look the part, but... I just got some cute house shoes. Let's see if they, oh, they don't fit. Oh, they fit just right. These are the shoes, y'all. I don't feel like repositioning my phone, but I give these an eight out of 10. They look like this fur is gonna, yeah, like this fur is gonna get everywhere. And I think these are, no, these are not one size fit all, but they're pretty cute to walk around the house in. Pretty. Pretty darn cute, actually. The next thing I got is this anklet. I just wanted, I just lost my anklets, or well, most of them, and I just wanna restart. So I just randomly got an anklet, and I should never got like a silver one. This is gonna rust. I'm not gonna wear this often, but it's just a cute little anklet, or you could wear it as a bracelet. Pretty cute. And last, last but not least, I got this lime green bucket hat that is going to go with an outfit for when I go out of town. I'm so excited about this because if you guys know me, I'm a neutral dresser and I really don't like wearing color that much. I mean, I do, but I, I'd rather, I feel more comfortable dressing myself in brown or black because I know I'm not gonna look stupid. So I'm really hoping this comes together as it's supposed to. I would, I look like the cat in the hat. I'm not, I, I'm not gonna take, mm, let's take the clip off. Maybe it will look a little bit more, you know? You know? Look at my clip, y'all. I got this from the beauty supply store. It's so cute. But let's put the bucket. All right now, maybe not cat in a hat. Maybe thing two. Things, I'm really feeling these pajamas. These are really cute. I should've got my sister some. But, yeah, this is the last item. It's pretty cute. Hopefully, it goes with my outfit, like I said. This is like them shoes. This fur is coming off everywhere. But I give this an 8 out of 10. Like I said, this stuff, like the fur of the hat is coming off everywhere. And why is, like, the seam in the front of the hat? It's just so tacky. Or maybe it's not the front of the hat. I, can, I mean, I could always turn... Mm. I don't know about this, but that's all. That is all for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, do not forget to subscribe and stay tuned for the following videos for when I'm actually getting ready to go out of town and then out of town. But again, thank you guys so much for watching. Do not forget to like and subscribe and tell a friend and tell a friend. Do not forget to thank God for waking y'all up this morning for that is so important. And if it's not morning, just right now, while you're watching this, when you finish watching this, actually pause this video and say a prayer. And yeah, I hope you guys have a great day. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.